Hi besties, welcome back to my channel. I just like literally spent a whole bunch of money fixing my room, like you know, putting in all those IKEA shelves and everything. But my AC fucking broke, and it's literally it's 34 degrees here. It's too fucking hot. I will die. And so yeah, I'm doing this in my hall instead. Okay. Okay, my house is like a literal bachelor pad. No one is all. Is home other than me and my puppy which is who's sleeping right here he's the best boy in the whole world as you, as you guys don't know well you must know i've been announcing them since the past six months before i even booked my tickets that i'm going to london but yeah now my tickets are booked my visas come everything so i'm officially going to fucking london not australia london anyway so for london i shopped a bunch of clothes but this is not a london shopping hall that is going to be everything else that is like that is too much okay but yeah, road cases are coming in. Slay, thank you, Sahaj. I spent a bunch of money, okay? So I recently did some more shopping. Like I spent thousands of dollars. So I was like, let me show you guys what I've bought. This is also my haul because I recently got out of a relationship like two months back. I got cheated on everything. So this is my way of, you know, making him cry, making him regret. I was like, why not take another opportunity to diss him? Um, you must be like, really, you do so many brand deals, everything. Why the fuck don't you just like buy a proper setup? I can do that. But this is like raw, okay? The raw feel at the plus like also I'm just like a cheap bitch who would rather spend more money on clothes and Starbucks. Mama is cheap, but not when it comes to clothes and not when it comes to feeding assholes who will never value me. For that, I'm never cheap. Oh my God, I want to be. How many fucking times am I supposed to be? Okay, so my sister has decided to interrupt my filming session and she wanted to ask me something urgently. So I don't know what it is. Let's see what you want to ask. Bro, does YouTube pay so much that you can afford such expensive clothes all the time? Well, okay, so YouTube does not pay me that much. I buy all my expensive clothes from the Friend app. But it's a social networking app, right? Yes, Friend is an application to make new connections. But they have come up with a new initiative called the Star Trainer Program, which allows you to connect with people, help build their confidence and skills. Okay, this platform can earn you money by grooming and training individuals. But I'm more of a real influencer on the friend app because I'm directly impacting people's lives. Okay, so what else is there in the app? Okay, let me show you. So this program is exclusively for women where you can make up to 1.25 lakhs by training and grooming people, helping them in building confidence and clearing their doubts related to communications, relations, friendships, etc. But what about the privacy and how much will they pay me? So your privacy is 100% protected. Uh, as no private information is required to be shared for providing training on audio call, you can earn rupees 4 per minute on an audio call. And for a video call, you can earn rupees 17 per minute. Which is way more than I make on YouTube. Which means if you spend up to 3 hours in a day, you can easily earn up to what? 45,000 rupees a month. Also, if there's no hassle, it can easily come to your UPI wallet. Okay, so we can speak in Hindi and English, but what about other languages? Yeah, there is no barrier. You can share your advice in your regional language, Hindi, Tamil, Telugu, Kannada, Punjabi. So it is very good for women who can't go to work, but have the ability to influence people. They can do it easily at home and gain financial independence for themselves. Thanks, but tell me how to register and get started. Okay, the, the registration is very simple. I'll just show you. Um, click on the link right here. Complete your registration by filling up your details. Don't forget to write my name in the referred by column to get an early access. And after registration is complete, within 24 hours, you will receive text and video tutorials on how to get started on the friend app. Don't wait, apply now and become a real influencer on the friend app and buy all your dream clothes that you could have never bought without it. Swear to God, if another one of you even dares to comment, you could have got the same thing at the current thing. Let me tell you, the clothing is not the same, okay? I spent 10k on a fucking set. You can't get it from there because the quality will never be the same. The skims quality, they are not serving. The quality, the fit is never going to be the same. I just have to say that, okay? I need to get this off my chest. This set from Addicted is like like literally perfect because it makes me feel like hotter than he ever did makes me feel more things than he could ever do it compliments me in a way that he never complimented me it is the perfect fit for me he wasn't the perfect fit for me but this is and yeah it's just so perfect it makes me feel good about my body unlike him he actually gives me a little butt so that's a good thing i swear to god i'm not gonna fucking touch paneer anymore like it is making me so bloated yeah can you guys see the entire thing can you guys see the fit it's so cute this is the only way i can show y'all the fit i don't know how else to show y'all plus i can't see because i'm literally blind but yeah this is the outfit it's so cute ah! <laughs> 
That's why did y'all let me do that? Talk about it. Why the fuck am I talking and dancing? Like I'm literally talking like. Y'all are gonna think I'm like full mental, and y'all are gonna think like I'm on some coke or some shit. But I swear to God, I am not. This is just me. Imagine if I was actually on the shit. Like, then it's done. Anyway, next outfit. This skirt from Wifa. I have seen it on literally everyone. I've seen it on every hot girl. This is just perfect. These are all clothes for London. Okay. I've not even touched them, but I was like, let's film a video about it first. Okay, I could have paired it with a better t-shirt. But the thing is, it's literally just like for the video. I'm just too lazy to go. But I have a white t-shirt upcoming in the video. But before that, I have to talk about other t-shirt to explain why I bought the white t-shirt. I'll just show you all what the skirt is first on the couch, which is my ramp walk. Um, so yeah, this skirt right here. Can you all see the skirt? Beautiful, tiny, tiny skirt. This skirt, people are like, really, you already have like pretty like, you know, shimmery clothes. I know I do. But you know why I bought another one? Because, you know, after being with him, like I felt like my life sparkle was gone. My own self sparkle was gone. So I was like, this skirt right here helped bring the sparkle in myself back. Did, so he took away the sparkle from my life and this skirt bought it back. Retail therapy, I love you. You are my therapist. Make the whole place shimmer. I'm gonna be the band. The S2, you have a band. I can just say I don't remember. I'm Hindi to be actor. I'm step to I need help. Okay, uh, okay, I know I need help. Don't remind me. Stop right here. I've never even like tried it on when I got it. This top is like very personal to my heart. A because I've seen every like Pinterest girl wear this top. This is how I wear t-shirts that I don't want to stain makeup on. Put your head up. You go like this. Then you wait until you put it your hands into the sleeve. I love this top so much. So why I bought this top is because this was like my personality before I met him, okay? This was my personality before I met him. If you don't know the importance of this top, then I can't teach you. You need to be a Pinterest girl. You need to be into fashion. You need to know at least the basic trends. I love this top. Like I have it in white. I have it in blue. Makes you look like hot. It like gives you like a full like up out there hot show. But it looks like, oh, you're not trying that hard. You're not trying at all. But you're looking hot at the same time. Then I bought this same fucking top in white color. I bought this to represent my personality after them, which is just like them, plain, dull, and simple. But at least on me, it looks good. I can still manage to pull it off and do something with my life about it. But with them, it's just, yeah, they're sad, pathetic losers. I said what I said. These pants, oh my God, again, are from White Fox, but like, ah. Uh, can you see how fucking uh, how <sighs> that was a whole cardio no mind not doing that again anyway so i bought these pants because it has shimmer and it's black in color you know i kind of like to be like taylor swift as my mother okay she didn't give birth to me but she's my mother she doesn't know that yet okay she became my mother in 2021 okay when i went through my first heartbreak <laughs> But yeah, anyway, that is like a whole another story. I'm like a fucking auntie. I'll just keep on talking about like 10 things at like one time. So I bought these pants because you know why? I was like, you know, I am always like, give me a midnight. But then I'm also like, look what you made me do. You say I did something bad. The vibes feel so good. So that's why I had to buy these because like the shimmer represents midnight. Right? And the black represents reputation. And I am just a midnight reputation girly, honestly. I'm a speak now girly. I'm honestly, I cannot pick a ta favorite Taylor Swift album because if I had to pick the most I listen to is like red. Currently, I'm listening to the Tortured Poets Department. And my favorite is current favorite is I'm Gonna Get You Back. But I'm more of like a better than revenge, reputation, and a midnight girl. Like, I'm under that lane. I want to be a folklore girl, folklore, but I don't think I'm a folklore girl. This corset is my dream. I'm not even kidding. This is the top. I'm not able to make the straps fit properly because no one's at home. I'm home alone. It is half zipped. It's not even like zipped properly because I don't know how to zip myself. I'm just like a dumb useless bitch. If I had to live alone, I would literally kill myself. So yeah, that's why I don't live alone. I live with everyone around, left, right, center. But y'all can tell this top is like so sexy, so hot. I am in love with this. This top just represents like, oh, I am hotter. Like this is the top you want to pull up in while you run into him at a club. So high, yeah. You remember me? The one you treated in the worst way possible who gave you everything, but you still treated like that? Yeah. It's like, I will always be hotter than 
make him regret like you don't need to make him regret but like you can like huh? why not recently uh ex of mine called me like seven months so surprised that he called me i was like oh i'm not the only delusion one he still does think about me but obviously i didn't go to meet him or anything because i was like bye bye boy bye it's over it's over okay, i didn't have anything to say for this top this is my first time wearing this top and now that i'm like wearing it while wearing it one thing i realized is that this top looked very easy it was extremely complicated just like him you know he looked so nice and so approachable but when we got there he was just more complicated like not complicated like oh yeah he's the complicated you should stay there not in that way like just complicated like a douchebag like as holy way like complicated this is my i am barbie and he's just ken corset top this i love this top and it's so perfect it is so cute Stop it! Are you seeing how happy these clothes are making me? He could never. The thing is, I don't want to be this. I want to make a video where my boyfriend is sitting on the couch right beside me and he's reading my fit. That's what I want to make. I want to make those videos, but I'm forced to make these. Someone changed the prophecy. It is the prophecy. I cannot help it. Don't want money, just want some company. I want to sing. He laughs at all my jokes and he says I'm so American. Oh God, it's just not fair of him to make me feel this much. I might just be in la 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 this is my reaction when he told okay this was my reaction when he followed my ex best friend uh yeah but following that girl is just unforgivable i'll forgive you but going behind my back and trying to be friends with her honey you are just digging a deeper grave okay it's like insanely gorgeous like literally insanely gorgeous yeah i'm holding it like this because i have not tied the hook because i don't know how to tie it so yeah you know he once fucking told me that i was a demon i was like okay i'll buy a demon like outfit but i'll be a sexy demon like okay i'll be a demon i get it you fucking find me a literal demon it's fine <laughs> but at least you know my tits will be looking good but anyway no the stop is just so sexy i love it it's like a ho-ho outfit which i honestly love you know y'all know how much i love my corsets with the deep neck okay Sufi Moti Wala, you know, who makes fun of me for wearing corsets. I'm like, I wear so many corsets. So I'm like, I hope I don't end up on his page. Plus, like, the boob jobs these tops give me is genuinely insane. And yeah, they save my money for the breast upliftment. And I cannot go through another surgery. It is. It, it is painful, okay? This dress, this dress is just so beautiful. This dress is like, and I'm just with my dress in the sun, yeah. Even my daddy just loves him. Like, I recently, I mean, and I have like just talking about this we were like just realizing i was like all of my exes they have had their best friends they've had like such a big impact on their like you know their male best friends they've had such a big impact on their relationships like you know whatever the guy best friend told them to do they used to do it like people say the girl best friend is the problem but i think the guy best friend is the problem these guys if they continue this pattern they're gonna mostly end up alone if they continue listening to their guy best friend they're gonna have to end up marrying them and yeah when they do end up with them this is what i'll be wearing to their marriage and then i'll wear a gap hoodie on top of it you, you know i was having this conversation with Sarah. i was like what is up with these boys idolizing their best friend like idolizing that oh my god this person has said this this is like the n word like it is like they put their best friend on this pedestal and they are like you know one of those people who are like just asking to be followed they are followers like they can never be a leader in life i'm done like being with the follow be a fucking leader i'm a girl boss be a boss in life the light is dying, so now I don't have much time to like shoot. But anyway, you guys must be like, Riddhi, are you like going to run track or something? So now this is this white fox, you know, track suit, 13, 13, 13, Taylor Swift for me, 13 means Taylor Swift. And Taylor Swift's lucky number is my lucky number. <laughs> Even though I don't know if anything lucky has happened on the date 30. This is just like, you know, I'm ready. I'm ready with my bougie deal with diesel girl boss heels on to run. Next time I see a fucking fuckboy, I'm not staying. I am wearing this and I am just It's gonna be like he's gonna be like hi and I'm gonna be like That is what's happening. Excuse me, what do you mean that I'm no ready you're gonna go into a relationship with that person and then cry? Cause you're just a fuck boy. I'm, I'm just realizing the amount of fucking songs I sing. So because the light is going, okay? It's literally 7.30. I don't know how this much light is also still here. Love you, Bombay, in that way. But yeah, this top, this top is like, you can wear it in like two ways. And why I chose this top? Because like, 
this is like too fierce this is also like just like all the snakes i've had in my life and yeah dusties this is it that's what it was that was all for today's video i hope you guys liked today's video i don't know if you guys liked it i think that this video is very boring but i hope you guys liked it because it was just like fucking me talking for like how many 10 minutes straight so yeah i just love you guys so much thank you so much for watching me i love you the next vlog i'm just gonna tell you what it's going to be about it's going to be me i'm going to london to london <laughs> So uh, I have to pack for London. Uh, I have gotten like, my bar facial. I vlogged it. I have done all of those things. The glow up, the diamond, and yeah. Anyway, let's go, my babies. I love you guys so so much. Thank you so so much again for everything. I love you. So grateful. Bye bye.